in this match choose to leave two null hatch panels off of their cargo ship in different locations, though. It looks like 4976 just barely getting one of those hatch panels to stick. We'll see if the cargo pushes it off of the cargo ship. And unfortunately for your Red Alliance, it does. So no points scored on that cargo ship during the sandstorm on the side cargo bays. Meanwhile, on blue, we've started work on the Blue Alliance lowest level of one of their rockets. And we have a cargo placed into the cargo ship. Harlem Knights in red bumpers trying to release cargo into their cargo ship. It looks like that ball might be a little bit stuck for Harlem Knights. They're going to readjust. It looks like they might head over to the other side of the ship to try again, but they're going to run into some defense on behalf of the Blue Alliance. 5406 Keltec, they raise their elevator. Very elegant green cabling running down the sides of their robot. They're going to move into position and now place two points with a hatch panel for your Red Alliance. That brings their score up to 37 points now, but Blue is in the lead with 44. 25-39, Krypton Cougars moving into position on a Blue Alliance rocket. 1660 Harlem Knights giving them a nudge to slow them down. Harlem Knights still do have that cargo stuck inside of their robot. It looks like they are using this opportunity to play some defense. More cargo coming in. That's from Pirate Robotics in blue bumpers. And a little bit more defense once again on that Blue Alliance rocket. 25-39 having some difficulty lining up due to that defense, but the panel sticks regardless. 40 seconds remaining, a 10-point Blue Alliance lead. Three points of cargo dropping in for Red Revolt right alongside them. They're now narrowing the gap. 30 seconds left. 4976 Revolt Robotics looking for a place to drop off some cargo, and they will add three more points to their score. Harlem Knights working on trying to keep 60-32 from taking the lead for your Blue Alliance, but those cargo drop in, and with 20 seconds left, your Red Alliance needs to race back to the half, so does Blue, but a collision will slow down members of both teams in our final three, two, one. In. Blue takes home 83 to 77.